My name is David Connick. I'm a senior lecturer and outreach coordinator here at Clemson University in the physics and astronomy department. So on August 31st, 2023, we're going to experience a rare blue supermoon. Uh, that's basically two events happening at the same time. So we'll start with the supermoon part. So a supermoon is when the full moon occurs when the moon is closer to the Earth. So the moon orbits the Earth, but it's not a perfect circle. Uh, there's times when the moon is closer to the Earth, there's times when it's further away. The closest the moon gets to the Earth is about 221,500 miles. So a supermoon is really when it's within about 223,500 miles of the Earth. We say that's close enough to be considered a supermoon uh, when the full moon happens at the moon's distance uh, within that limit. Uh, for the blue moon, the blue moon is a little bit trickier because it's more of a folklore historical thing. Uh, there's not a lot of scientific aspect to that. There's usually 12, blue moon, 12 full moons in a year, which means there's about three full moons per season of the year since we have four seasons. Uh, so a blue moon is when we have four, blue moon, or four uh, full moons in one season is the original definition of blue moon. Uh, the current definition of blue moon is actually now two blue moons in a single month, two full moons in a single month. Actually, a blue supermoon is super rare uh, because we have two fairly rare events having to line up perfectly. So a supermoon is somewhat rare in that it happens about twice a year. A blue moon is a little more rare in that it happens about every two and a half to three years. The blue moon was because we have an extra full moon. So all the full moons of the year actually have historical names. Uh, they vary depending on culture. A lot of the ones that we use in America come from the Native Americans. So normally the August full moon is called the Sturgeon moon. Um, so when we have two full moons in a season, or an extra full moon in a season, we need a new name for that because all the other 12 names are, or 12 full moons are taken. Uh, the original reference is from like a farm, fa uh, farmer's almanac. Um, so the, that's the original uh, source of the blue moon name. What's interesting as an astronomer is I know that we have models that can predict these way out into the future. So for thousands of years into the future, we pretty much know exactly when the, all the super moons will happen, when all the blue moons will happen. Um, the main effect that the moon has on the Earth is the tides. So we do have what we call spring tides that happen every time we have a full moon, where the effects of the moon and the sun align and make the tides a little bit stronger. So with a full supermoon, maybe those tides would be the tiniest bit stronger because the moon's a little bit closer than normal. A blue moon is not actually blue. Um, again, I'm not exactly sure where the blue came from. Um, the only way a blue, uh, the moon can look blue is really when the light coming from the moon is altered somehow. And that is going to be from usually pollution in the atmosphere. And specifically for the moon to appear blue, you need kind of large particles that are gonna reflect or uh, refract, refract the red light coming from the moon and allow the blue light to come through. To come through. Uh, that can sometimes happen when a volcanic explosion happens or when you have just the right kind of pollution from industry. But in general, the moon is not going to appear blue and it certainly isn't going to be to appear blue um, on August 31st this month. Um, I highly recommend looking, uh, taking a look just after sunset as the moon is rising above the horizon. There's an effect that makes the moon look even bigger when it's near the horizon. So in addition to the super moon making it look maybe 15% uh, bigger than normal uh, on average, uh, that illusion of the moon looking big when it's close to the horizon will be most apparent just as it's rising, just as the sun is setting. 